My signature dish is Magreda Canard. That's a roasted and sauteed duck breast with potatoes, figs, and grapes. It's a very traditional, old-fashioned, and classic French dish. It really takes me back to my first day in Paris. I will never forget it. Roger took me to Paris like 30 plus years ago, and he took me to a little old hole in the wall in the Marais, and they had only one thing on the menu, and that was Magret de Canard. And when we ordered it, I thought, what is that? That's duck? I had never seen duck that looked like that before, because back at home, duck is always baked, and it's dry and gray and stringy and kind of unattractive. And this looked absolutely divine on the plate. So I try to recreate this dish when we want a quick trip back to Paris, especially now that we can't really travel like we used to. So I did it for the judges. And I think that this dish is definitely going to wow the judges because it looks fabulous, it tastes great, it is a sumptuous dinner, it is very filling, and it's good for you too. So I want the judges to take a look at it and realize that I'm putting myself on the plate here, I'm putting Parisian fashion on the plate, but it's not just all about fashion. It's not all glitz and glamour. It's uh, traditional, it's classical, it's kind of ordinary, it's old lady, French lady food. It's like what my grandmama used to want to have. Natural food, plainly cooked, with the best ingredients and the best flavors, all on one plate. So I like to try to see if I can elevate ordinary food in the home and make it really special. And I wanna have a party at my house every night. And this is one of those special, special things. If you make this, it's so easy. Everybody can do this. And you just need good duck breast and prepare it in the correct way. So I'm gonna take this beautiful duck breast that I've let rest. I've sliced it and look, it's still pink on the inside. It's so luscious. Look at that. And so first, I'm gonna take some microgreens. I actually grew these uh, greens on my deck. And I have a little potato pavé. I think I'm going to take one of the duck breasts. Look at that beautiful duck breast. Magre de Canard. I'm gonna place him just like that so everybody can see. And I think I'll give a couple of other slices just here on the side right there, like that. Look at that beautiful pink color. So that's that. And I also have a delicious crispy duck skin. And I think I will put that over here, just like that. And one of the things that goes really well with duck is a beautiful, sweet thing. You know, people always do duck a la range, duck with cherry sauce, duck with plums or peaches or apricots. But I grew up in Arkansas in the shadow of my mammal's fig tree. We had peach tree, plum tree, apricot tree, pear tree, apple trees. But my favorite tree was the fig tree. We had black figs and we had green figs and I used to eat them raw medium raw and, and almost falling off onto the ground. So I've cooked some figs and some grapes to give that extra special touch with some raspberry vinegar. And I've cooked that down with a little bit of brown sugar. And that's gonna give me a beautiful, nice, sweet finish. This is a delicious, easy sauce. It's very traditional, very easy, and everybody can do that. I'm gonna clean up my plate just a tiny bit here. Don't wanna present a nasty plate. Huh? 
So, and I also have some little champagne grapes. I'm gonna take some champagne grapes over there and a little more champagne grapes. I love these little grapes on the stem like that. And a couple more figs. Figs and duck together are a match made in heaven. So here I've got a little bit more microgreens. I'm gonna just stack them all around here. And sunflowers. What grows together, goes together. Sunflower greens right there, just like that. And I can put a couple of more potato batons. Right? And voila! There is my Magre de Canard. And on the side, I'm going to put just a tiny bit of fleur de sel. So that is my signature dish. And I hope the judges enjoy it because it's one of the things that I really love. It's one of the things that Roger really loves. And I really feel like it's a taste of old Paris. It's really a real thing. And I am a real thing. I want everybody to realize that I'm not just all of this glamor and fluff and fabulosity. Behind all of these designer clothes, there is the real Tommy who is all about ordinary goodness. Life is worth living. And I like to live in full panoramic color.